Hey everyone, Jason back once again with another NASCAR Diecast review. Today, we'll be taking a look at the Ryan Blaney 2022 Next Gen Worth Ford Mustang in 124 scale produced by Lionel Racing. Now, I picked mine up for my friends over at CircleBDieCast.com. At the time of recording this review, they are currently out of stock on this particular release, but I will link the 164 scale version in the description below if you'd like to add that one to your collection. Before we get to the die cast itself, let's go ahead and take a quick look at the packaging that the 124 scales come in for 2022. It is completely different than 2021 and previous years. You get half a box. On the side here, we have Lionel Racing Next Gen 2022 Season, 124 scale, Lionel Racing, the official die cast of NASCAR. The car comes screwed to a black plastic base like normal with a plastic cover bubble to protect it. On the top of the box here, we have LionelRacing.com as well as Standard Finish and the NASCAR Cup Series logo. On the end of the box here, we have the Action Racing Collectibles logo, as well as NASCAR. It says, be sure to register your car's DIN number at LionelGarage.com, as well as a production sticker. It says, Ryan Blaney, number 12, worth 2022 Mustang, and they made 504 of this particular die cast. This side of the packaging is the same, nothing on this end. All the relevant legal information can be found on the bottom of the box. All right, let's go ahead and take a quick and detailed look at the die cast itself, starting off here on the window banner. We have Ford and Blaney, and between that we have the cooling ductwork replicated. On the hood we have Worth, and right above the H and W we have the simulated vents. Got silver painted details for your hood pins. Pinzoil Ford Mustang, got the number 12 right there, right below the right headlight. Got the notched front splitter, replicated nicely. Got Sunoco in front of the front tires. Goodyear in blue, right above the new low profile next gen tires. Got the single lug chrome wheel with rotor detail behind it. This car features functioning steering. This is the ARC release, so it has opening hood and roof flaps, no opening deck lid and plastic chassis. Got the NASCAR Cup Series logo right there. Number 12 and worth going down the side of the car. Below the number two on both sides, you will find the exhaust on the rocker box right there. Up on the roof row, we have Ryan Blaney and the number 12 on the roof. Right here, you can see they actually molded in the escape hatch on the next gen die cast. Got the front and rear camera got the front camera there and right above snap-on got the rear camera the car does function have functioning roof flaps the number 12 is nice in white outlined in red as I mentioned snap-on we got Blaney here on the rear window this is number 206 of the total production on the B post here we have Ford PBG Mizak Dent Wizard and discount tire with advanced auto parts and DEX imaging on the C post Got the ethanol ring right there, get bioethanol, Wabash, and Menards on the quarter panel. Got that half red and clear spoiler with silver painted details for the fasteners. Back here on the rear TV panel, we got the simulated tail lights for the Ford Mustang as well as Worth. Got the simulated quad exhaust and 2022 Michigan Ford license plate as well as the number 12. You can see that rear diffuser sticking out below the rear bumper. Here is the bottom under wing of the car, as I mentioned, working steering. But you can see the different fins of the rear diffuser going to the back. And there you go. Rear diffuser looks nicely replicated. I think what Lionel could have done is on the real cars, the under wing here is carbon fiber. They could, I think they could have easily used a decal and made the under wing look like it's carbon fiber instead of just black plastic it's my only little complaint i have with the car the right side of the car is about the same as the left side no major differences once again the exhaust sticking out of the rocker box right below the number two got detailed interior digital dash details got the uh, fire extinguishers towards the front of the car now instead of towards the rear full containment carbon fiber seat does have a cloth window net right there Let's go ahead and see if I can get this hood open. There we go. There's your interior or engine detail on the next gen die cast. You got the cooling vents that go from the vents up on the hood into the uh, actual ductwork there. Blue valve covers. On the inside of the hood, we have powered by Ford and Worth. So yeah, it's a solid release, as I mentioned. Definitely one of my favorite liveries of 2022, and probably my second favorite 
Ryan Blaney livery, his advanced auto parts next gen car is equally as awesome as the Worth car. So yeah, if you enjoyed this review, give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more. I post new diecast reviews throughout the week. So be sure to click the bell for notifications. You can find me over on Twitter at JasonAStrain69. Hope you enjoyed my review of Ryan Blaney's 2022 next-gen worth Ford Mustang. See you next time for an all-new Diecast Review.